abs of Jimmy and I. He did post a video the other day about women lifting heavy weights. And so I wanted to honor Jimmy, Jimmy's question by giving you my two cents on that. Every woman is different and they develop muscles differently. Um, genetics play a huge role in that. And so when I used to teach strength classes, I would always tell my class this, so if you take my classes, you've probably heard this before, but if you haven't, take it into consideration. So what I'm gonna do, make sure, okay, it's nothing, it's not very impressive right now. But I want you to look at my bicep and go in the mirror and do the same thing for yourself. And what I want you to notice is that the distance between the muscle and your elbow, okay, so if it's about two fingers width distance from the muscle to the elbow when you flex it, you have what's called an average muscle belly size. And so you are going to build muscle like the average woman does. So if you lift a lot, you'll probably put you know, a little bit of size on. If you don't lift very often, you'll probably be pretty small. Now on the opposite scale of that, if your muscle belly is short, you're gonna have probably three finger lengths between your elbow and that muscle. And what that means is that you will be the kind of person that develops muscle quicker and bigger. And I'm average to um, short muscle belly, so I do. If I lift a lot of weights, you see it. I really start to bulk up. Um, I could be one heck of a uh, bodybuilder if I wanted to be, but not my cup of tea. So also, if you look at your muscle belly and you don't have hardly any space between the muscle and the, they call it the eye of your elbow, you have a long muscle belly. And so you've got that long statuesque kind of ballerina look. No matter how much weight you lift, you will probably not pick up a lot of bulk or a lot of size. You won't have, you know, bulging biceps. You'll be strong, which is really, really important, but you won't see the, the muscle development that you would in someone with an average muscle belly or a short muscle belly. So, Jimmy, I think every woman should lift weights because that increases your metabolism. Right? And not only that, but it's very, very good for your bone density. So lift weights, but knowing whether you have a short, long, or average muscle belly is going to help you understand what it's going to do to you physically and how you're going to look. Because everybody, even if they lift the same weights, is going to look different from the next person. So honor that. Appreciate that you're an individual and you're different from the person next to you and you're beautiful just the way you are. Lift weights. Do cardio and eat something good, okay? Love you guys, bye.